Hello, Mr. Horse here. At your service. I haven't used that phrase for quite a while, but I want to.、Uh, I want to remind you that I am here to to provide a service to you. By presenting the best music, vocal music, vocal, not instrumental. I mean, if you want to listen to the best instrumental music, you can listen to classical music. Johann Sebastian Bach. Just to kind of、um, give my、uh, fingers, you know, some exercise. Just doing the you know, C major. I mean, C major is good. Um, this is part four of the sound of silence. This is the heart of the song. People talking without speaking. People hearing without listening. People writing song. Their voices never share. No one dare disturb the sound of silence. Now, what does what does he mean by? People talking without speaking. I mean, it's the difference between talking and speaking. People talking without speaking. People hearing without listening. People looking without seeing. People learning without knowing. I mean, the, all these phrases, you know. Of course, I added, you know. They all express the same idea. I mean, talking. Now we say talk. People talk, talking. I mean, you know, just making some noises, making some sounds. Right? That, that's really talking. I mean, so you know, we say people talking, talking, talking. All he does is talk, talk, talk. Now, what does it mean? I mean, we don't say 
all he does is speak, speak, speak. And there's a huge difference between talking and speaking. Talking really means, you know, just produce sounds. Nonsense. We say talking. He's talking nonsense. Talking nonsense. I mean, if you want to be rude, you can say, well, he's talking bullshit. BS. I mean, in Chinese, we say dog shit. He's talking dog shit. Absolutely no, no meaning. You know, I mean, he doesn't communicate anything. So, talking, BS, nonsense, producing a lot of noises. But we say speaking truth, you know, I speak the truth. So speaking is about real, authentic, honest communication. Talking is the opposite. I mean, this is what the song, the main theme of the song is about. It, it, it's the lamentation of complete lack of, you know, authentic, real, meaningful communication, as Mr. Garfunkel puts it. Speaking, people hearing without listening, people writing song that voices never share. No one there disturb, disturb, disturb the sound of silence. So so there is absolutely no no meaning, you know. What 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 Paul Simon saw in this vision, this vision what number one is people do not communicate whatsoever. People do not communicate. Well that that was nineteen sixties, you know, but in twenty twenty not only people do not communicate. We went further than that. I mean, I'll you know I'll explain to you, you know, in in in, in a few minutes. People hearing without listening. We hear, or we do not listen. Okay, I mean that's another. That's another thing, right? I said, well, I hear some noises, I hear some sounds, but I didn't, I, I, well, because it's noises and sounds, so I didn't listen, because it's nothing important. There is, you know, it's nothing, you know, uh, significant. It's just some, you know, sounds, I mean, you know. You hear or you don't hear, it doesn't make a difference. It, absolutely no difference in your life. These, these noises and sound. But if somebody's speaking the truth, or try to speak the truth, then you should listen. You need to pay attention. Now, the difference between hearing and listening is, are you paying attention? Like right now, I'm talking to you, right? I mean, I am talking. You might, you might, you might say, well, you know, Mr. Horse, you're talking nonsense, you know? You may think I'm talking nonsense, I'm talking noises, I'm talking bullshit, but I think I'm trying to speak the truth. So I think you really should, you know, pay attention. You should you should listen to me. People hear the 
So, the result of you know not listening, but of course not, there's nothing to listen in the, in the first place. I mean, the the reason why people don't listen is the you know one is there's nothing to listen, two because it's all bullshit. Number two is um, people just don't learn from the the past. They don't listen to their, you know, the parents, for example. They don't listen to, you know, uh, people, elders' wisdom. So they continue to make the same mistakes. They don't listen. You know, I mean, you try to tell them, hey, you know, this is the right way to do things, but they won't listen. People writing songs that voices never share. Now, here's another new thing, another thing here. People writing, people writing songs that voices never share. What does he mean by that? Well, he is talking about the narcissism. I mean, that really defines our time. Narcissist, narcissistic. I mean, people are so narcissistic. I mean, what does that mean? That means everything is about me, me. Hey, especially you know, this is you know, really m more true in the in, in the Western world. I mean, look at the you know, mass media. I mean, not the mass media, social media. Everybody is you know trying to. I mean, trying to bring attention to themselves. All these, you know, influencer, you know, so called. What are they doing? They're trying to say, "Hey, look at me! You know, I'm, I'm great. I'm so great. Pay attention to me. Don't pay attention to others. I mean, to, to me. Watch my video." my nonsense I mean watch my watch my bullshit I mean then that's what they're saying you know narcissism there's no empathy for others you know it's just this strong sense of and you want people to admire you I mean you want people to worship you I mean everybody wants that I said, well, Mr. Horace, you are, you are making videos. I mean, you know, are you, are you one of those, you know, narcissists? No, I'm not. I'm bringing you the best music, the best songs, Chinese and English songs, in human history. I'm not talking nonsense. I mean, I am speaking the truth. Like it or not, I mean, you know, I don't care if you like it or not. I'm, I'm not arrogant. I'm not trying to be arrogant, okay? Like those people. Narcissist. It's a big word. I mean, you know. So Paul Simon saw that. In 2020, I mean, you know, people will live. I mean, he's still living. He, see, he, he sees with his eyes. I mean, people live in a narcissistic culture, society. I mean, world. So that's, you know... But the thing is, no one dare, nobody dares to disturb the sound of silence. Everybody is so afraid to, 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 you know, I mean, to, to face the reality, I mean, to face what is happening. Everybody is so scared of, you know, disturbing the sound of silence. See? I mean, that is the point. 
I mean, that's the point of the song. And Paul Simon was right on. I mean, this is a sick world. I mean, this is a sick culture, you know. I mean, especially the Western culture is so sick that you know I don't want that, that to come to Taiwan. I mean, it's already in Taiwan. It's it's in in uh, in China, but we'll try to resist that. You know, poison. I mean, you know, poison. This Western poison. I mean, we don't want that. We don't want the narcissism in our you know in our in our society in our life. You keep that to yourself. Anyway, that is. The third verse of the sound of silence. I hope you enjoy, you know, the interpretation. <laughs> 